Hey, hey y'all. We about to pack lunch for the kids real quick. Just like getting a salmon sandwich. CJ getting a grilled chicken breast sandwich. Really, we just throw everything in the air fryer. It is 520. I gotta go wake the boys up in about 15 minutes. So we're gonna go ahead and throw some olive oil on here. Season it up. We're gonna get breakfast started and then we're gonna go wake them up. <sighs> so I already cleaned both my chicken breast and my salmon with some lemon juice and some vinegar, pat it dry. This chicken breast is kind of thick. So we're gonna take this and we're just gonna cut this in half. Like that. Now we're gonna take our olive oil, drizzle it on top. I have to be out the house by 525, y'all. And then we are going to go ahead and add our seasoning. So I got a little bit of lemon pepper. We're just gonna season them both the same way. We got some Tony's. I just, I just, I just don't even know what to say. I just don't even know what to say. I just don't. <sighs> now I'm gonna be walking around here smelling like roasted garlic. Oh my gosh. All right, now we're gonna try again with the roasted garlic seasoning. Sheesh. Take our meat and flip it over. We're just gonna try to soak up some of that oil with the seasonings on it. Small things to a giant, you guys. Small things to a giant. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and proceed to season the other side the same way. Paprika. Okay, once we have everything seasoned, we're gonna get our handy dandy air fryer liner. I got this from Amazon for like $5, I love it. And we're just gonna put our salmon and our chicken in the air fryer. I normally let this go on 400 for about 15, 20 minutes. The salmon will probably come out first, but we'll check it because the chicken breasts are kind of thin. It is about 526. All we're gonna do is go ahead and put our, um, oh, I think my microwave is acting crazy again, y'all. I was gonna say put our bacon in the microwave, but I think I might end up doing it in the oven. All right, we got our handy dandy bacon. This is from Sam's Club. And somebody told me I should freeze this bacon instead of keeping it in my refrigerator. It don't expire to January 7th, y'all. Sam's Club lasts a long time. I'm sorry, bacon lasts a long time. We had three packs, and I think we got it like a month and a half ago. This is our last pack, but it wasn't necessarily needed to freeze it because of the way bacon preserves. It's good until January. Now, since my microwave is tripping, I'm going to toss this in the oven on 400 for about 10 minutes. I don't have any foil either, so we're gonna have to make it do what it do on this cookie sheet. And hopefully it doesn't stick and act crazy. Y'all, I promise, I'm gonna get that microwave replaced. I already got the serial number off of the inside. We just really need to order it, but it's just being lazy, haven't done it yet. It still works, it's just be acting crazy. 
and you know how that goes you don't miss something until it's gone i need to go ahead and order it before it goes all the way out but let's just get this bacon on this cookie sheet get this in the oven so we can go wake the boys up and i think they are actually already up but i need to go up there and double check Okay, I'm gonna wash my hands and we're gonna come back and put this in the oven. All right, y'all, we're gonna make them kids some pancakes, but we're gonna call them waffles because we put them in a waffle maker. We are using this pressed ease pancake mix. I really don't know if it's a difference between pancake mix and waffle mix. I always just use pancake mix. Um, waffle mix might actually have a different texture, but maybe I'm not buying both. So, we're going to put our pancakes mix in there. That's the light and fluffy buttermilk by Krusty's. We're going to start out with a half a cup of water. And just get in a mix and see if they are thick enough. Hmm, maybe they'll look too thick. They look like biscuit though, so we're going to add some more water. That should be enough to get us good and going. Mix mix mix. Alright, I'm gonna put a splash of vanilla, a little pinch of cinnamon in here, and then we're just gonna go ahead and put them in a the waffle maker. Got a splash of vanilla. Go ahead, go brush your teeth and wash your face. Mm -hmm. We got a little cinnamon. I need an apron. I'm gonna wipe it up. Now we're gonna spray this down. And I got this waffle maker from Walmart for like $5, y'all, I'm sure. I think it was doing a Black Friday sale or like right after a Black Friday sale. But you always can get these with like $10 or less. So we're gonna add our waffles, let that do what it do. And while they do what it do, I'm gonna go ahead and get the rest of the lunchbox snacks out put these seasonings up real quick so I don't spill them again. This the one right here that want to get me out of trouble. Okay, that's the perfect thickness for our waffle, y'all. Let's get these lunchbox snacks out. Pause. Don't want to burn my waffle. I think it's done. Our first waffle is done. Get ready for our second one. I think I'm gonna make four if I have enough mix. They probably will only eat like one. Just so you're not a huge breakfast person anyway. And I think I overfilled this. It's probably gonna spill out, but it's gonna be okay. what a cutting board is i do not see the big wooden board anywhere y'all be like how you lose certain stuff i don't know that cutting board is big like where could it be where could it be anyway let's go ahead and get started on cutting up our vegetables for our sandwiches i'm just doing some lettuce and tomatoes we're gonna toast up some bread add a little mayo and lunch is gonna be done. Let me get my lettuce and tomatoes out. 
normally we use romaine. I sent that man to the store. He likes iceberg. So that's what we're going with this morning. Because that's what he picked up. Now take this and wash it off. Y'all, while I'm sitting here having the best conversation ever with y'all and my camera died. Anyway, I washed the lettuce and tomatoes. We got them all sliced up. We got our last waffle going over here. And I think it's done. So we're gonna go ahead and unplug our waffle maker. CJ already up, he came down here, he was talking to me. I told him go ahead and make sure he brushes teeth, wash his face, I'm gonna go get his clothes. Get Josiah up, it's 5.45, we need to leave about 6.20, 6.25. So we have time, our salmon and chicken is done, our bacon almost done. All we gotta do is pack up the lunch boxes and get the boys down here by like 6.10. Let's go. We need to leave the house by 620. Let's go, let's go. All right, y'all, I got some clothes out for CJ. Real simple, jeans, t-shirt, hoodie, socks. He finna put this on real quick. I'm going back downstairs so I can finish packing everything up. And this isn't nor our normal routine. Normally, I wake them up first, but I got up a little early this morning, so I let them sleep while I got started on everything. Guess what I did? Burnt the bacon, burnt it to a crisp. <laughs> Burnt it to a crisp, baby. Burnt it to a crisp. I can't believe this. I can't believe it, but I'm gonna put some in the microwave. This is exactly why I go for what I know. Tore that bacon all up. I went upstairs for nothing but five minutes for it. Come back, it's, it's gone. It's disintegrated. Disintegrated. What's the word? Whatever. It's so up. So we're gonna take some more bacon here and we're gonna put it in the microwave and see how that works out for us. Hopefully it goes a tad bit better. Y'all see this? Y'all see where the oven got us? Nowhere. It got us here. All right, the boy's wrapping up getting dressed y'all, so I'm gonna go ahead and toast some bread so we can start making sandwiches. We leave it in 10 minutes, Sire, 15. Once I made the noise, I'd be hearing those stairs. Mm -hmm. I'd be like, boom. Where are you hearing it? I hear from upstairs, but it was coming down here. Is this something the cabin door slammed or shut? Get your, uh, probably. Get your tan shoes. Did you get my lunch box? No, tuck your pockets in and get your tan shoes from upstairs. Mom, my boot leg is right there. Where's your car mat? On the couch. All right, y'all, we're going to scramble up some eggs real quick. I kind of want some eggs myself, but we don't have any avocado. And I just, I love avocado with eggs. It makes them 10 times better to me. So we're just going to cook three of them today. I'll make me some later. I might stop at the grocery store after I drop the boys off. I really don't know what my plans are today. Just gonna kind of wing it. With our eggs, we just put some butter. Sometimes I add milk, sometimes I don't. Sometimes I scramble them in the bowl. It just depends on how I'm feeling that day. But we're gonna get these scrambled up, make plates for the boys, make our sandwiches. Pack them lunch boxes and then we we're heading out. And we have about 
15 minutes to get that done. All right, let's get these breakfast plates together. We got eggs. We got bacon. It's a little Cajun too, but it's okay. I don't know what's going on with the bacon this morning. We got waffles and we need an orange. We have an orange. Just gonna cut that one, two, one, two. All right, y'all, we gotta get out of here. So we about to make these sandwiches up real quick. We got our mayo. It's a little toasty in here this morning, y'all. I don't even have my heat on, it's hot. All right, y'all, we got our salmon and our chicken out the air fryer. Chicken. We're going to add our lettuce and tomatoes. Our buns on top. Sam's just getting ready to go. All we gotta do is pack the lunch boxes. We got the lunch boxes, y'all. Let's go ahead and get everything packed up. We're gonna get these sandwiches in a Ziploc bag. All right, first we're gonna pack up CJ's lunch. That man bought Sunny Delights from the store. I don't like Sunny Delights, they are super sweet, but CJ asked for one. So we got a Sunny Delight, peach cup, hot fries, go go active squeeze applesauce. Which one is it, y'all? Which one the chicken? Which one's the chicken? Which one's the salmon? I just said I wasn't gonna mix them up. Just the chicken. So we got our grilled chicken sandwich. And then I need to get him something sweet. Yeah. We gotta go with Oreos, y'all. Yeah. Tell them how to go Microsoft Flight Simulator. I'm gonna get your Microsoft Flight Simulator. Today? Yep. Let's get this side all packed up. We got Gatorade, hot fries, fruit cups, our grilled salmon sandwich, Oreos. Oh, and our go-go active sweet applesauce. We'll get this tied up. And y'all know we can't forget to drink our water and mind our business. All right, y'all. So we got everything packed up. All I got to do is grab my pocketbook, these lunch boxes, and my water bottle. And we good and ready to go. Lay out, bye, y'all. Lay out, bye, y'all.